Welcome back, Space Coast Dragon. Continuing our uh, Tales from the Commonwealth uh, adventure. And I believe we are ready to go on our next quest, which was kind of given to us. Uh, uh, yeah, actually, you know, that was it. Uh, like a good neighbor. That's the one that popped up after uh, uh, getting. Uh, what's his face? Uh, I believe it was Bobby. So uh, we're going to have to go to good neighbor and take care of that, see what's going on. Um, and before we go though, I'm going to make a mention of two uh, mods that will also be showcased during this video. I'm not going to show them right away, but uh, you'll probably see them throughout the playthrough, which is why I'll bring them up now. Both of them are going to show up at night. The first being Visible Galaxy 4K by Space Goats. And what this does is it uh, creates a very, very pretty looking uh, like Milky Way that's visible in the night sky. Fantastic, uh, great mod to, uh, to look up at the night Hope sky. Hope that wasn't too much of a hassling deal with Kane. Welcome to the team. That's nice. I'm busy. Uh, go away. Um, and the other one I got coming up is gonna, that you'll probably see as well is Illuminated Billboards Lighting, and this is by Alastora. Uh, this one, what this does is it takes the billboards throughout the Commonwealth and illuminates them, um, and it looks really cool. Gives it a uh, Gives it a bit of a kind of a cyberpunkish Blade Runner kind of look to the world. I guess I don't know. That's probably the, the wrong description, but you know what? It works. Um, yeah. So that said, we're gonna go talk to Bobby and uh, see what we need to do. And apparently, I don't know where I need to go to talk to him. Do I? Maybe I have to go to Good Neighbor. Doesn't say. Of course not. Um, show on map. Yeah. Alright. I'm guessing, because Bobby, Bobby was the, uh, was that cool we just saved, right? I mean, it wasn't that long ago, and now I'm already forgetting. <laughs> yeah, you're not Bobby, right? You took care of oh, you are Bobby. Rhett. Never mind. Nice. Here's a bonus. Thanks, dude. Oh, some caps. I like that. Alright. So, um... All right, I guess I'm gonna talk to you about more work, but first, let's let's get some details on you. Uh, yeah, about the size of your crew. This is a pretty small crew. Did something happen? A crew is no different than a gun. You spray enough bullets, and pretty soon you gotta reload. Fair enough. Um, yeah, and uh, are the Minutemen a problem for you guys? You know, uh, not that I'm like the leader of them or anything. <laughs> what about the Minutemen? That a problem? Not at all. Those dumb shits are the best thing that could have ever happened to us. They kill off rival gangs, check. They got plenty of deserters who want to join up, double check. And they're spread out so thin, they'll never hold the Commonwealth for long. You son of a bitch. Those are my people. I'm the only one that gets to call them dumb shits. Eh, fine. Uh, anything you need me to do for you? Yeah? Uh, kill some more of these rival raiders of yours help uh, get rid of your competition before I get rid of you you have any work we're low on junk so we're gonna have to rough up some chem dealers to make up the difference you're gonna need a disguise though for good neighbor just pick up one of the masks off of the corpses we leave in the cells Diamond City's a little trickier you're gonna need a guard uniform which means you'll have to find one I'll leave that up to you Making it look like a typical Diamond City shakedown is the only way this doesn't come back to bite us. Okay. So... I gotta look like a ghoul, and I gotta look like Diamond City Security, both of which are apparently optional. To rob a guy. Who, what? Who stole, who's Sullivan? Why am I sticking him up? What do you do? So I can either get the ghoul mask or the guard uniform, or do I do both? Oh, I think I gotta do both. Alright. So, first things first, the mask. Want to arm wrestle? I'm up no. Well, first you gotta pick which arm you wanna lose. Alright, so there's a mask up here, apparently. Oh, one of them sells. Uh-huh. Oh, oh, wait. It's not actually a mask. Ew. Son of a... Son of a... Hmm. 
Well, unless she's actually wearing a mask and isn't really cool. Yeah, that's it. Nope. Alright. Um. You could almost hit these old machines, Rusty. Yeah, yeah, you sure can. Uh. Alright, Preston, you're probably not gonna like this, so I'm gonna I'm gonna put you back at Starlight and uh, I don't know, get McCready or something. Just saying, you might get pissed off, because that's what you do. I mean, hey, okay. So here's what's gonna happen. They're they're like rival gang guys anyways, raiders probably, so they're all bad guys anyways. And I mean we're gonna clear these guys out in the long run too, right? Most likely. I don't know. We'll see, but uh, yeah, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, we're gonna run back to Starlight, and I'm gonna pick up a, pick up a new friend. Sorry, dude. All right, here's a little look at the, uh, the visible galaxy, 4K, overlooking the night sky. Like I said, very nice, and it's uh. Not that dark out right now, it's getting near the morning time, so that's why it's uh, a little brighter, but very nice looking looking mod there. Alrighty, so yeah, just a short distraction before we get back to Starlight, and we'll probably be able to see the illuminated billboards at some point during the adventure as well, like I said. And if it doesn't happen naturally, I'll just make it happen, because that's what uh, that's Dad, what I do. you want me to carry some of that valuable gear you're lugging? Just, uh, just let me know. Hey, you know, it's, uh, it's, it's funny you brought that Last up. Last time we uh, talked, I hope I didn't bore you to death by dumping my life story on you. Um, mm, mm, no, no, it's it's important to you. I'm pretty sure we already had this conversation, um, but yeah. Hey, if it's important to you, it's important to me. I really appreciate you saying that. And the fact of the matter is, you're the closest thing to family I have out here. As we've been traveling together, I'm... Finding it easier and easier to share my feelings with you. Anyway, I just want you to know how much your friendship means to me. Um, yeah, that, that's cool, dude. Uh, we'll be friends, all that good we'll stuff. We'll always be best friends. I don't think I'll ever get tired of hearing you say that. Remember, if you need anything, you be sure and let me know. Yeah, now, yeah, we're, we're gonna go, uh, gonna, gonna do some dirty work, alright? Hey there. Just gonna there have to deal. Are. I almost thought you forgot about me. We were just talking. We were literally just talking. You know, I'm almost tempted to just say no now. You know, no, let's go. Time to hit the road. About time. I was getting bored. I'm sure you Good were. Good luck out there, McCready. Still wasting your time trying to save the world, huh, Garvey? Yeah. And, uh... You really are one of the good guys. That's yeah. please. And, of course, I do still have Garvey with me as well, but, uh... Because I got the multi-companion framework thing loaded um because i'll be making use of that when i run across the uh companions that are uh that can show up in uh the tales from the commonwealth uh whenever that happens i'm not sure exactly where they are but uh I'll, i want to just kind of stumble across them eventually i'll probably just try to find them but in any case uh yeah garvey hey what do you need go away um oh we got to talk first right right hey you should give yourself credit sometimes you really are one of the good guys. Yeah, that's why I'm not bringing you with me. Um, I already know you think Thanks, so, though. Preston. I already know you think so. I know, but I don't know if you really get it. How unusual you are. Since we met, I think you know I've really come to respect you. Both as a leader and as a friend. Uh -huh. Most people are just out for themselves, one way or another. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even yeah. the good ones. But you're different. You really care about other people. Even when it isn't convenient or even safe. I've seen you risk your life more than once to help people just because it was the right thing to do. I just wanted you to know that. Yeah. Um, that's cool. Uh, yeah, you just described yourself. Uh, you just described yourself, Preston. I hope you realize that. Quite the mutual admiration yeah, society. Yeah, it sure is. No, but I hear you. Mm -hmm. All right, enough chit chat. Yeah. Keep leading and I'll follow you. Damn it! I wanted to just for so many years. Your goddamn help. Hey, just point me to it. You want to swap supplies? No. No Damn problem. It. Wrong one. 
Hey. What is it? Go away. It's time for you to head home. No, we don't. Oh, no, that's right. He is in Sanctuary. I got him set up here because I don't want him around here. Not Nothing wrong with you being here. You're just better over there, Preston. That's all I'm saying. Now, now shoot. I'll head home. Don't get yourself into trouble out here by yourself. I'll be just fine. Not abide my Jesus. Come on, McCready. Let's go. I don't know. We gotta find a Diamond City guard. You know what? Let me see if I got one myself. I highly doubt it, but it's worth checking. There's no sport. I don't think I ever kept one of those. Nope, no Diamond City stuff. Fine, we gotta go. We gotta go uh, find find a way to get some of those without getting caught. That'll be fun. All right, here we are, Diamond City. Um, notice a little bit of more greenery and stuff here. Uh, that's actually not to do with the uh, another green mod. Uh, a little bit of the stuff is like the ground and stuff, but all this stuff is due to uh, a mod called Living Diamond City by Noob Tuber Once. 17 and uh, we'll probably also see his other uh, one of his other mods I've got installed uh, when we go to good neighbor called good neighbor reborn basically these uh, redo up the areas make them nicer to visit um, I'm doesn't add any new areas that I'm aware of just uh, you know makes them makes them feel more alive I think there might be a few more like random NPCs maybe included as well I could be wrong on that uh, I'd have to look at the description uh, later uh, I'll probably just put a little annotation on the Chinese radio signal. Ooh. All right, that has to be from uh, Tales from the Commonwealth. Hmm. Chinese Radio International. I'll check that out at some point. <laughs> uh, we're in the middle of another quest at the moment, but hey, uh, now I know where to come for my next quest. Nice. Real clean. Strict entrance requirements, though. Yeah, not since I've uh, been around. Oh, I bet you he's where I can get my Diamond City uniform. Oh, what, what are you? You hungry? Noodles? They're amazing. What's up, Taka? Send me out with some of your Shima, uh, Shima Changa, or whatever they're called. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what's up. Damn right, I'll take two servings. Oh no, I gotta shake him up. That's right. That's okay. Never mind. Um. Resident. Yeah, I think that's okay. You look like you need a prescription filled. Something to settle your nerves, let you chill. Uh. Hmm. No, 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 I'm good. Gonna pass. No worries. Mm hmm. Yeah, because I gotta talk to you about hey, something. Hey, Solomon. Gotta pick me up if you're feeling glum. Uh. Ah, jeez. Do I have to have done his quest first, or do I, I gotta be anything. in the... You do your thing. That's right, I gotta be, I think, in the Diamond City uniform to... Okay, fair enough. Got too much dirt. Which means... Hold on here. Stick up Solomon, stick up Fred Allen. Alright, so I need to find and equip the Diamond City Guard uniform, probably to stick up Solomon. Alright. Of course. So, got good neighbor to stick up Fred Allen, and then stick up Solomon right here. Not here. Wait, 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 did I just see somewhere to find a uniform? I did. Way the frick. Help defend count. Help defend count. They're under attack. Why am I? No. It's made me think there was another uh, little marker for this quest. Man, you won't bastards it. over there. All right, Diamond City uniform. Let's see. I'm probably gonna have to kill a kill this Diamond City guy. Or there's gotta be another way to find one. Maybe there's a dead one from like a mutant attack or something. I didn't even think of that. Derp. One of the illuminated billboards. 
Oh, oh, oh no, he's down. Bastards. That's it, dead. Alright. Starting to have fun. We took him out, guys. Uh, oh, oh. Well, at least we got some Diamond City uniforms, right? I, I mean, their deaths won't be in vain. They took out some super mutants. Find anything useful on them? Uh, yeah, actually. Um, pretty much. Wait, does that not count? Find oh and equip okay, fair enough. All right. I'm like Diamond City now, right? No, is that not enough? Am I missing some more stuff? Arm, right arm, helmet. I got everything. Seriously? Am I gonna have to, like, uh, take that off, too? No? Whoa. Oh, you know what I'm missing? The athletic outfit. Yep. Now? No? Oh, come on! Totally Diamond City right now. It's all this stuff that's not not related. I gotta take off, then, isn't it? Oh, seriously? What am I missing? Okay. Uh, I guess we'll take a. Uh, no. All right. Hold on a second. All right. I just looked it up. Apparently this should work, so unless there's unless this stuff isn't uh Man, unless this isn't vanilla. I don't know. Cause it said the the arm stuff it should only be the the suit and the Hmm. So in which case, if that's the case, I don't know if I got anything though on that's uh I don't know, that would be considered that, but... Okay, I just looked up, uh, apparently, though, this... The, uh... Diamond City armor I got, this stuff is indeed, uh... Vanilla. But it apparently doesn't work. Or maybe it's just not saying anything, but I mean, I, I got it and I equipped it, right? So... Okay, it looks ridiculous underneath the mechanist armor here, but, uh... Let's get that on, just to, you know. Alright, well, we'll see if, if I can uh, talk to Solomon and deal that stuff now. That'll work. If not, screw it. Uh, apparently it's a little little issue with the, uh, with the mod. Um, it happens. Seriously, it's not like a... Oh, you talking Everyone to each other? in this city's always jumping at shadows. Uh -huh. Chill out is what I say. Yeah, man. This is a hold up. Whoa. Your money. Something all of it. Heavy now. Is going down. Oh shit. Okay. Um. It'd be simpler if you just hand over the money in chems. That's cool. Yeah, I know money's kind of an imaginary thing anyway. Two hundred. That's all I can pay. I swear. Okay. Um, yeah. No offense, guys. Polly, Mo. Um, just, uh, had to take care of some business. Y'all understand, right? Okay. Come on, McCready. Let's, uh. <laughs> Apparently that worked. Alright. 
<sighs> Let's get that cool mask on and uh, head on and head on. Back to the neighbor. Robot ghouls here. Wolfgang. Some. Oh, hey guys. <laughs> That's right. Y'all ain't dead. Wait, I can. Y'all are. You're a trader now. Hi. I can trade with. Yes. Now, anyways, what are yeah. we doing? Holding up somebody. Who are we holding up? No defend. Oh, whoop de doo. They'll live. God, they can't defend themselves. I give them enough defense. They're just whining about it. Fred Allen. Freddy Allen. Where you at, bro? I'm a ghoul, and I'm here to here to take care of business. Are you in the Hotel Rexford? You handle your own problems, or you end up dead. Yeah, I know. Running hey, guys. Something? Welcome home. Drifter. What? You dry? But, uh, oh, look at, see, dark, way dark at night, look at how that shows up, that's fucking awesome. Uh, anyways, this is Good Neighbor Reborn, like I said, like, uh, with Living Good Neighbor, uh, or not Living, I mean Living, uh, the little Diamond City. Sprucing stuff up a little bit, a little extra randoms, you know, good times. Let's get in the hotel. Fred, are you going to hang out in the lobby all day again, or are you actually going to go down and do some work? Being available to the customers is work. It's not all about cooking chems, Claire. It's not all about sampling those chems either. Maybe if you stop using, you can focus. What? Where's the fun in cooking it if you ain't using it? My mistake. Oh yeah, also, side note, I've actually not gone into this hotel and this character's playthrough yet. It's amazing how much I've put in with uh, with this character who's basically been my main playthrough guy uh, and how many little things I have not even touched. So, yeah. Anywho. Alright, Freddy Allen. You. Don't go to sleep. This is a hold up. What? Your money. Oh, all on. of it. Now. what I do this time? Uh, dude, just, just, you know, you're a user and you owe money, alright? So, just comply. It'd be simpler if you just hand over the money in chems. Ah, uh, okay, you got a point there. Sorry. Okay, 300 caps, that's all I can put out? Fair enough. Alright. So, you know, we just dealt with the, with the, you know... A uh, drug, a couple of drug peddlers took their money and stuff. So you know what? I think I actually see that as a as a good thing to help society, right, McCready? You understand, right? I understand. Uh, let's get this mask off. <laughs> oh, and let's just get rid of this stuff. Or should I keep it for my collection? I think I'll keep it for my collection. And sunglasses. All right. Yeah. All right, McCready, let's go talk to Bobby. You ain't met Bobby yet. He's a bit of a douche, and he looks like he's a juggalo, but, uh... Yeah, no, seriously, I know, right? But, uh, yeah, he, he's, he's paying us and stuff, and he's a raider, and we're eventually gonna kill him. Just, uh, you know, not right now. Something to take the edge off? Fred Allen, Hotel Rexford. He'll hook you up. Uh, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. He, uh, he sure did. He hooked me up, all right. Yep, yep. That's right. Just, just hooked me up. <laughs> okay, let's just get out of here. Hey, yo, Bobby. Bobby. Guess what, man? Hey there. Kendra's finally kicked the buckets, and I hear oh. we got you to thank. Yeah. Here's a little spending money. Sweet for uh, some Kendra Kendra. That's a raider I like killed a million years ago. Yeah, yeah, I took her down. Yeah, totally did that. Just now hearing about it. Yeah, I guess word doesn't travel fast sometimes. 
Anyways, uh, did your little stick up job with the junkie dealer guys. So yeah, that's that's all all good. The job is done. Good, good. It'll be a while before those chem dealers try and short us again. Here's your pay. Sweet. I don't have any more questions. Fine. Mm -hmm. Like a good neighbor complete. Nice. Alright, well then, uh, I guess that might be it for the... Nope. Rock'em Sucker Robots asked Bobby for more work. Alrighty. Well, I guess we are not done with these raiders, uh, yet, McCready. So, uh, but we're done for today. So anyhow, yeah, that's uh, been the second part of Tales from the Commonwealth. Fantastic quest mod. I am definitely enjoying it. And this is, of course, just a small taste at the moment. Uh, with this raider crew, little quest line, bounty stuff, whatever's going on with that. Um, in any case, next time, I guess we'll be rock'em sock'em and some robots. But uh, this has been Space Coast Dragon. Go ahead, hit that like button. Go ahead and subscribe. You know, don't steal mods as usual. And have a wonderful day.